Maybe yesterday. Let's not exaggerate things. Oh. oh, cool. That's so cute. Sorry, now I'm cooing. Not very professional, is it? <laughs> Hi. You could not have been born at a better time, my little thing. Because there's so many wildebeest around, the lions aren't going to want to eat you. Touch wood. Hopefully. <laughs> Let's see how it walks. Okay, nice and sturdy on its feet. But of course, all little animals like baby zebra, antelope, giraffe, they can all stand and walk within easily, to, well, within around about 20 minutes of their birth. Well done, Mummy. Look what you made. You made a little miniature. Little spotted thing. Yes, aren't you proud of yourself? Giraffe, baby giraffe, of course, have one of the hardest entrances to the world, bar perhaps elephants. Um, that two-meter drop, because the females don't lie down to give birth, must be significantly traumatizing. What a way to enter the world. Welcome, thud. Let's go a, a bit closer. I'm going to inch closer, just because we can't zoom much more than we were. Pfft. Nice and slow. It's okay, mommy. We don't mean you no harm. She's very close to the hyena den, which isn't ideal as a place to give birth. Okay, we're just gonna have to do this slowly. Hello, mom. It's okay. I, she, she's not going to respond to the tone of my voice or the fact that I'm talking to her at all. I'm doing that purely as a comfort to me, I think. Old habits. Elephants do. Elephants do respond. But things like giraffe do not. Or maybe they do. I don't know. Can't read their minds. Hello, my girl. Can we come and have a look at your baby, please? It's so perfect. And Mrs. Zero, you'd like to know how much the baby would weigh. There we go, let's have a stop here. And let's just get a look. Sometimes when you stop, the animal gets more uncomfortable than it would have otherwise. So Mrs. Zero, you're looking at probably, I would guess under 100 kilograms. So under 200 pounds. I think, if I remember correctly, giraffe babies are actually quite large when they're born. Unlike something like a rhino that sits at around about, mm, when their babies are born, around about 40 kilograms. All oh, the wildebeest are coming back. There you go, baby. There at the back, that's the wildebeest on their way, returning. I would say that baby probably doesn't weigh much more than 50 kilograms, actually. That's brilliant news for our baby wildebeest because it really does mean that the predators are not going to be interested in it. Look at its flopped forward ossicones. 